the COVID-19, the economy sank. In fact, the data that we have shows that the economy sank to negative 0.27% in terms of growth. So you can imagine then, it becomes quite like a whole uh, issue of a very severe recession. And for us, we have to understand then what that recession does. In 2021, for example, even after all these effects, the economy rebounded to 7.57% on account of weak economic base that was there in 2021. And of course, thereafter, the economy has stabilized and we can see some, some growth of 4.8% uh, in 2021. But you have to relate that 4.8% in terms of what can it relate to? How can we actually look back in terms of the kind of demands or the kind of aspirations that we have? And uh, since then, the economy uh, is slowly being projected to grow at 6.7%, especially in this current fiscal year of 2023-2024. And those sectors that have been targeted by the bottom-up economic transformation agenda are those sectors that we believe are going to provide a very large impact to the rest of the economy, create a momentum for growth, but more importantly, will affect a majority of the people.